This is Dr. Roger here, and I know today is a very difficult day because of what went on, the tragedy that went on in Las Vegas, a terrible thing that happened there. And uh, I just want to invite us all to hold those who moved into the greater dimensions in our prayers along with their families, as well as those who've been injured in this horrific experience. And you know what, it, what I would like to impart to you is that uh, we need to grieve let our hearts grieve for sure and beyond that we need to tend to our hearts because there are really two options when our hearts break we can close them down and then shut out the world and get discouraged and get jaded and pessimistic or we can let our heart breaks open us open our hearts and call us to an even greater vigilance for the vision that we hold valuable a vision for a world of compassion where compassion becomes the norm, where love and unconditional love becomes our standard practice. And so when we have heartbreaks like this, terrible things that happen, it's really a call to hold the vision even more powerfully, even more passionately, so that more and more we become instruments of kindness and, and tender-heartedness. And, and we start lifting that up to be the positive new norm. And a tsunami of kindness begins to be what people copycat rather than the horrific things they see on the news so often. So I just call you to do your grieving, but keep your heart open and return to that vision of a world that works for everyone, of peace in our lifetime, and moreover, of our capacity to live from open hearts, healing hearts in this world of ours. That's the way we can respond, and that's what makes a difference. That, that's what grows us as we experience these things on this earth plane. I love you. Let's keep on walking in this high vision. God bless you.